Hey guys, what's up? My name is Nate. You guys might know me as Mewtwo Fan Nate. And today I am here welcoming you to our Pokemon Y Baby Combo Lock. Now, for those of you who do not know what this kind of Nuzlocke variant is, it's pretty much a combination of a Baby Lock and a Combo Lock. So the Baby Lock portion of it means that you can only use first stage evolution Pokemon, for example, Charmander, Bulbasaur, Squirtle, uh, Fennekin, all, all the, the baby Pokemon, Azuril, Pichu, Elekid, all, all, all of this stuff. You guys should be kind of familiar what a baby Pokemon is if you're familiar with my channel because we have been participating in the uh, APA, the Little Cup League, so it should be pretty fresh uh, in your minds. Now, the, the combo part is something you might not know what exactly it is. Now, I saw this um, from Shady Penguin's channel a long time ago, where he started a combo lock on Pokemon Y, and it pretty much had to do with rolling a dice. So it's, depending on your dice roll, will determine what you do with your encounters. So, uh, for example, uh, the dice rules that I have determined, uh, if we roll a 1 or a 2, we are keeping that encounter. If it is a 3 or a 4, it is getting Wonder Traded, and... The, the thing about Wonder Trades is that a bunch of people um, who are still playing this game after uh, it came out in 2013, they are usually breeding for like shiny Pokemon, whatever. They're trading off their, their breed rejects most of the time. And which means that we are probably going to get a bunch of uh, pretty decent baby Pokemon. Because, uh, I mean, uh, you, you know what I mean? Like if they're, if they're Wonder Trading, uh, maybe... A uh, Scyther or something like you know that's still kind of a baby Pokemon technically because it evolves like I'm I would count it personally now uh, for now I said three or four is a one trade now if we roll a five that is a re-encounter we re-encounter that Pokemon uh, if we get it it's a Gumi and all of a sudden I I, I roll a five it's and then it, it's a re-encounter and, and then next thing you know I get something like like a fungus, which is still pretty good, but let's say I wanted that Gumi. I don't get that Gumi anymore. Now, if we roll a six on the dice, that is called an all-star Pokemon. So that is a Pokemon that I will have pre-generated into the box, pre-gened, meaning, uh, and, and those are Pokemon based off of, you know, different content creators, friends, things like that. So for the Kyle A, we'll have an, uh, an Apom. For um, Crimson Seabad, we will have a Growlithe. Like, th things like that. Uh, and, uh, and, and you guys will see if we end up rolling a, a 6 for an all-star Pokemon. But without further ado, let's start. Now, I don't normally, like, I try doing voices when I first, like, because I, I did a Pokemon Y Nuzlocke a long time ago on the channel. I deleted pretty much all of it. But, and it, I, I, I don't know, how, like, I'm not doing voices because it makes my throat hurt. And I... And it means that, and it's also embarrassing because I tried giving Sycamore a French accent, and it, it was it was absolutely terrible. So obviously, we know what what this guy says. And also, while while he's talking, doing his thing, this is pretty much the the, the way we're going to be doing it. I have a dice inside of I think this might have been like a deodorant spray can or something like that, and. Pretty much what we'll, we'll be doing is we'll be shaking this up just like that, and then I will be revealing it like this, and that would be like a six. You see what I mean? So we're gonna pick our character here. Tell me your name, and I'm actually we're going OG status, my original birth name. That's right, I'm naming myself Nathaniel. That way, when they ask me what I want for my nickname. I'm not Big N, or Little N, or N Meister, I could just be Nate. So it's Nathaniel then, did I get that right? Yeah, you, you did. You did, got, you got that right. Tres bien! I actually, like, forgot everything about this, um, like, like, about the, like, the storyline. I, I, I remember, like, what happens to a certain degree, but I don't remember everything. So 
so it should be cool. Alright, so we got the, the Fletchling. I wonder why they never made a Pokemon Z version. Like, I felt like it would have been so good. Like, I, wa I want to go back to Kalos. I really, really do. Oh my god, having like these little chibi forms of, of these guys? Okay, I think I- do I click on the mirror? Is that what happens? Nathaniel clicked on the mirror. Do you guys remember the trailer for this game? Like, oh my god, this was like the most hype. Like, I bought a 3DS. I bought the limited edition 3DS for this game. Can I? I still have it. <laughs> like, it's it's perfect. Perfect. Yes, mom. Yeah, our mom was was kind of valid. I'm not gonna lie. Like, she was kind of. Hmm. She looked kind of good. Okay. I like how they have, like, full, like, character models, like, when you first open up the door, and then as soon as, like, you see them, they're, like, these, like, little chibi characters. It's kind of funny. Alright, we got Serena, we got Shauna. And, uh... They're gonna be waiting for us in the next town over. Alright, come on. Let's go. Sweet, sweet. Well, let's play with our... Okay, never mind. Why is it nighttime in my game? There you are. We were just talking about you. Come on, have a seat. This is the meeting place, Nathaniel. Here, let me introduce you. Everyone, this is Nathaniel. Wow, Shauna's description was spot on. This is Tierno. He's got some serious dance moves, and this is Trevor. He never misses a single question on his test, but he's a little shy. Oh, uh -huh. all right. Nice to meet you. See, that's a voice. That's the voice I'm giving him. If you call each other by nicknames, <laughs> can I call you Enmeister? No. <laughs> no way. He's a little lad for sure. What do you think, Trevor? Well, well. What? You want me to do nicknames when I just met Shauna? You can't just put me on the spot like this. I'm not doing nicknames. That, that was terrible. I'm picking my end. I'm picking my own. Picking my own. There you go. Perfectly planned and executed. You can't put me on the spot like that. Yes. Can we see the new Pokemon now? Is he singing? I didn't even notice that he sung that before. I just noticed like the little musical notes. I'm not doing voices. That was terrible. Let me let me know in the comment section down below. Also, now that you guys are probably watching at this point, there will be a question of the day that pops up randomly during the during the uh, video. If you answer that, there's a good chance that you have a uh, like that you are gonna be nicknamed after a Pokemon because I'm terrible with nicknames, and I'm just gonna nickname a Pokemon after you. Now, when I originally started my Nuzlocke, like the first time I did it, I chose Chespin. But this time around, I'm going with Fennekin, because Fennekin has a pretty good special attack stat. And I think the first gym leader is like a bug type gym. And I want to make sure that I have something that can take on the, the Vion. Alright, we're going to we're gonna nickname this. Uh, it's a boy. I'm going to nickname this uh, after my boy Rujo. From my Twitch chats. Go check out my... Go peep my Twitch, because we might be grinding for, for this game on Twitch. Alright, sweet. Alright, we got our Pokedex, and we're probably going to get our Poke Pokeballs pretty soon, too. Like, I'm pretty sure the Nuzlocke starts, like, immediately. Actually, no, 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 it doesn't. I think we, I, I don't remember. I should stop trying to remember because I'm not going to. It's just been way too long. And Kalos kids are chosen to carry a Pokedex and go on an adventure, but you need to give that letter to your mom before you can go. Why do I need mom's permission? I'm a big boy now. All right. Neat, wait. 
I'm gonna be your opponent. Okay. You asked for it. You you literally asked for this. Yeah, Shauna's got them short shorts on, looking cute. Alright, we got Rujo. I remember when they gave us stab for the first time, like as soon as um Like as soon as like, you get your Pokemon, like I, there's no like scratch pound battle. I remember I was super hyped about that. Look at that. Hopefully Rujo doesn't doesn't mind Fennekin. <laughs> hey, I wasn't done watching my cute little chess pin yet. Give me your money. Alright, alright, we're good, we're good. She's gonna heal my Pokemon right away. Alright. Let's give this letter to Mom and let's, um... Get started. Also, I think these episodes are gonna be about, like, 20, 25 minutes each. Hey, come here. I bet that if you and Serena battled each other, you'd get, both grow from the experience. That's, is that not my mom? Did I go into the wrong house? Oh, I went to the wrong house. So what did you and the neighbor's kids end up doing? Wait one second, Nathaniel. Is that a Pokeball you have there? You got your very own Pokemon? Lucky you. How about that? You're a trainer now, too. Congratulations. Huh? A letter for me? It says it's from somebody named Sycamore. Could it be? A love letter? Wow. What lovely handwriting. Mm -hmm. What do we have here? A request? Oh, I see. Nathaniel. We barely unpacked and all kinds of exciting things are happening. Okay, let's get you and Fennekin ready on your journey. I mean, I didn't get to read that letter personally. I bet it was a love letter. I even packed to change of clothes. My, what an unexpected turn of events. It's just a sudden last burst of speed from a racer in a Rhinehorn race. You made friends, you met your Pokemon, and now you get to take a lap around Kalos. Oh, and don't forget this. We got our town map. Let's go. Uh, yes, I do know how to use that. That's my boy. All right, I don't know what this Professor Sycamore wants to see on your trip, but taking a journey with your Pokemon is a really wonderful experience. All right. Raw. What? What? What is that? All right. I'll be fine. I'm a big boy now, Mom. I literally don't need anything else. I know that there's like shops and stuff around here. Pretty sure I could technically buy stuff, right? Let me talk to you. We only sell the best potions. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna buy a couple potions. And all my Pokemon have three lives. I'm not sure if it was quite obvious based off the layout because I don't think I said that already. And I got a free potion. I could have gotten four. I forgot about that. All right. I play with my Pokemon and pet it. My Pokemon and I are going to train really hard. Well, you come square up when you're done. Specialized shop. We only sell Pokeballs. Okay. Um, hold on. I'm not comfortable buying these yet because I don't want my Nuzlocke to start. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I think, because I think we're going to get free Pokeballs too. Hold on. I think if I'm getting free Pokeballs... Okay, if I'm getting free Pokeballs, I'm I'm not trying to buy any. The first Pokemon is always a Pidgey, by the way. I remember once I randomized, like I randomized it, and then I saw the game, then I 
tried to re-randomize it, and I, I didn't realize that, like, that was the case. So, if you didn't know that, now you know. I feel like is gonna be really good. It's got some decent stats to it. Alright, we got a cutscene here. Come learn how to catch Pokemon with me. Serena's mom and dad are amazing trainers. That's why she knows so much about catching Pokemon and battling. Well... Mom and dad may be good, but that has nothing to do with me. Okay, now watch carefully, you two. All this stuff I already know. But Nellaby would be kind of cool. I wish I could- I wish there was a speed up button for 3DS. If I did this on Citra, then I could probably do it- like, I could probably speed it up, but like, I can't. Should I like, just skip this, like... Alright, cool. I think I edited that out because we don't need to know how to catch a Pokemon. Wow, the Pokemon went inside the Pokeball! Shauna, what do you think your chestnut is inside of right now? Alright, so we got Pokeballs. I got Pokeballs. All, all my... I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, okay. Alright, come on. Stop talking to me. I want to catch my first Pokemon. Uh, give me something good. It's a Caterpie. Alright, sweet. So our first Pokemon to start the lock is a Caterpie. And we're going to scratch this thing. String shot. And Caterpie doesn't really get any moves, so this is like really bad. But... It's got a string shot, so, um, it's alright. Lower some speed. We can probably teach it Bug Bite. And it's got three lives, so it shouldn't be that, that bad. Now... It's not really like an ant or anything like that, but I'm going to name it after my boy Ants. Alright. Its feet have suction cups designed to stick to any surface. It, ten it tenaciously... Ooh, big words. Climb trees. Okay. Tenacious. Tenaciously? Ten tenacious. Tenaciously. I know that word. I'm just struggling with, with saying it. Alright, so let's name it after my boy Ants. Young young Anthony. It's a female one, but it's alright. Alright, what else was in here that I could have caught? And I'm like, gonna be upset that I didn't catch? If... I'm per okay, so it looks like if we even tried that twice- Oh, wait, hold up. Wait. We might have to wonder trade this. That's a four, so that is a wonder trade. So we actually have to wonder trade that. Forgetting the rules of my own lock. All right. So, if I go online right now, we have to wonder trade this thing. Okay, guys, we are back, and we have uh, we are ready to start our Wonder Trade. And we're taking our Caterpie. Hasty Nature Shield Dust. Okay, we got to take a look at our uh, Fennekin as well. So, I'm sorry, Ants. You're, you're gone. You're, you're leaving. All right, we got Jeremy from Germany.
Hopefully we get something good. We have to wonder trade this until... Okay, that doesn't count. We have to literally wonder trade this until we get a baby Pokemon. So as soon as I get something that is a baby Pokemon, uh, I'll be, we'll be back. All right, so we get we got somebody from United States, New York, named Kai. Hopefully Kai gives us a baby Pokemon. That's a baby Pokemon. That's a Flabebe. All right, sweet. Sent over Fa. All right, let's go. All right, let's go check out our both of our Pokemon here. We got Fa, level 12. Tackle, Vine Whip, Fairy Wind, and Lucky Chant. Nice! Nice and fairy type. All right, sweet. So... Uh, what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna just I'm gonna potion up real quick on Rujo. and uh, Fa Fa is kind of strong level twelve for for beginning uh for the beginning of the 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 route so youngster Austin with the zigzagoon having a fairy type early on is pretty good I would say. All right, I'm gonna have to ember him. I think, and I also have—I haven't gone offline, so there's gonna be someone challenging me for a battle, so I have to turn that off. <laughs> Look at—we must have some really good IVs, cause that did nothing. Growl me, bro. I'm a special attacker. All right. No. Let's and let's get offline. All right. So, we should be able to get another encounter in here. Something will happen if I stay by you. Okay. All right. Now there is species clause as well, so if I end up running into something that's like uh, another caterpie, Oh, we got a scatter bug. Is this should just be a mono bug lock? <laughs> Jeez. All right. Hold on. Let's roll the dice to see what happens to him. Remember, one and two, we keep the Pokemon. Three and four is a Wonder Trade. Five is a Reencounter, and six is an All Star Pokemon. So that is a six. So that is an All Star Pokemon already. So what we're gonna do is we're just going to scratch you. Uh, it looks like two of them. And then we get to trade you out. So, sweet. I'm actually, I have to remember to not be too salty about encounters because I could be wonder trading them away. And the, like, I, but I guess part of the hype about like this kind of thing is that I can get something really good, be really excited about it, and then I have to re-encounter it or wonder trade it away. So I feel like part of that emotion is going to actually help the series. I don't know. But some of you guys might be yelling at me in the comments, like, or just looking at your phone screen, just thinking I'm an idiot. I don't know. Okay. So we're just going to call you... Uh... RP for replace because we are going to switch you out now I actually haven't jetted any of the Pokemon yet but I have an idea of who I want to switch out so now that we've made it to the forest uh, I think what we're actually gonna do here is we're going to save our game now that we have three three Pokemon um, technically and you guys will see in the next episode um, it's like what Pokemon we actually put at the party. It'll be right on the layout. So make sure if you guys enjoyed this episode, uh, if you wanna, if you wanna hit that like button for me, I'd appreciate it. Subscribe if you're new, and uh, I will see you guys next time. All right, bye.